and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be about the affair of the poisons, which is a poisoning scandal in France that involved a mistress of King Louis XIV of France. Okay, so before we start, it is a little bit windy and rainy today. So if you can hear that on the video, I'm sorry about that. And also because this video is about a scandal that happened in France, I will be attempting to pronounce many French names. And for that, I am so sorry. In 1675, Madame de Brinvilliers a uh, French aristocrat, was put on trial accused of conspiring with her lover, Godin de Saint-Croix, to poison her father in 1666 and two of her brothers in 1670 to inherit their estates. It is also rumoured that she poisoned poor people when she visited hospitals. When Madame de Brinvilliers was arrested, she was tortured and confessed to the crime. She was then sentenced to death. On the 17th of July, she was tortured again with the water cure. She was then beheaded and her body burned at the stake. Now, this incident sent shockwaves through the French court with many, including King Louis XIV, wondering whether they could have been poisoned too. In 1677, Magdalene de la Grange was arrested on charges of forgery and murder. Now, after she was arrested, she claimed that she had information about other crimes, including crimes where people had murdered another person by poisoning them. King Louis gave permission for Gabriel Nicolas de la Reine, who was Lieutenant General of the Paris Police, to investigate this and to root out the poisoners. So a number of fortune tellers and alchemists were rounded up. They were suspected of selling divinations, aphrodisiacs and inheritance potions, i.e. poisons. They were, of course, tortured and some confessed, given the names of their clients who had brought their poisons, to get rid of their spouses or a rival at the royal courts. One of these people arrested was Catherine de Hay Monvoisin, otherwise known as La Voisin. She had been arrested after her name was given by Marie Boss, who was a poisoner, fortune teller, and an alleged witch. La Voisin was a fortune teller, commissioned poisoner, and a professional provider of sorcery. She was the head of a network of fortune tellers in Paris that provided poison, aphrodisiacs, abortion, magical services and arranged black masses. And she had the rich and famous amongst her clients. So among her clients were Olympia Mancini, the Countess of Soissons, Olympia's sister, the Duchess of Boyon, the Duke of Luxembourg and Madame de Montes Pon. So Madame de Montespan became Louis XIV's mistress in around 1667 and they had seven children together. She was his chief royal mistress. When questioned, La Voisin claimed that Madame de Montespan had come to her for help in gaining and keeping the king's love. Madame de Montespan had first visited La Voisin in 1665 and together they carried out special rituals that would create a special love potion for the king. They would pray to the devil for his help in securing the king's love and to express their gratitude they would sacrifice a newborn baby by slitting its throat with a knife. Afterwards, the baby's body was crushed and blood drained from its body. And the blood and crushed bones would be mixed together to create the love potion for the king. Madame de Montespan would then put this love potion in the king's food and she carried on doing this for the next 13 years. In 1666, Madame de Montespan had allowed the priest Etienne Gibourg to perform a black mass over her naked body. Now, after Madame de Montespan had been accused of using witchcraft and poison on the king, Louis suspended the public proceedings, but ordered for the inquiry to continue. But to avoid scandal to the king, Madame de Montespan's involvement in the affair of the poisons was hushed up, but Louis did call in his affections towards her. She was never actually tried for her part 
in the affair with the poisons but in 1691 being out of favour with the king she retired to a convent in Paris with a pension of half a million francs. La Voisins was sentenced to death for witchcraft and poisoning and was burnt at its stake on the 22nd of February 1680. 34 other people were sentenced to death during the trials for the affair of the poisons. Two people died in prison while several other courtiers were exiled. So that is the affair of the poisons and how a mistress of King Louis XIV of France ended up involved in it. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, like and subscribe and I'll see you next time. Bye! Thank you.